Whenever there's an opportunity, opportunity to learn, honestly, and in this case also to share, um, it was very interesting for our board and obviously for myself as well. It was all about learning and sharing at the first meeting of the Local Control Funding Formula Collaborative Working Group in Sacramento. The group was formed by the California School Boards Association and California Forward. And that's what we've initiated is a learning collaborative among a dozen or more school districts in the state, a very diverse group of school districts, but all who have one thing in common, a need, a desire, and an imperative to improve results in their community. Officials from 15 school districts and two county offices of education in California were represented. How were they chosen? CSBA's Vernon Billy said the goal was to make sure it was the right cross-section of leaders. Here's a district that's a basic aid district. We want them at the table. Here's a small district. We want them at the table. Here's a di district that has a high concentration of low-income students. We want them at the table. So it was a number of factors. As the hard work started, the three dozen or so leaders concentrated on how they can identify and promote practical implementation strategies that school districts can use to benefit their students. Hearing success stories, hearing challenges, sharing those, um, and that's where the collaborative and groups like CSBA and, and California Forward can help us. We do have a super diverse group in here, and I'm hoping you know, we don't get too focused on surveys and process and really get down to action. Ideas that you share and able to generate action items that uh, would be translatable to ultimately at the end of the day serve children in our school district. As the group worked together, some preliminary themes about how they'll spend their time working over the next year began to emerge. How do we best communicate with stakeholders about LCFF implementation? What decisions should be made to improve student success? And how can we have a broader conversation about the adequacy of school funding? Have no doubt about it, the collaborative is ambitious and time consuming. And these are very busy people immersed in running their own school districts. How will they know if this collaborative will be successful? We want to be able to learn how best to measure how are our students doing comparatively to what we, they were at the beginning. And then at the end of this, we can say, yes, we learned some new techniques from this group. We implemented those, and now we're successful. The collaborative will meet again in early January. This is Ed Coglin, California Forward reporting.